Okay, let me first make sure I am ready to do this video because there's gonna be so much talking. I hope you guys are ready for this brand new Ultimate Team video. First things first, Richard Sherman, and you also have a 92 overall top ready added to your account right now. And these guys will be 92 overall until February, I think 4th or 6th, I can't recall, but one of those dates, I believe 4th. So let's go ahead and recap the Super Bowl promo. You have the moments, you have the mystery MVP, you got the Super Bowl legends. And today, on this episode, we will go ahead and complete the set. Not only are we going to do that set, but we're going to go ahead and do Super Bowl packs. Yeah, so here are some of the Super Bowl legends that you can get out of that set, which we will complete today. There's some players like Tracy Porter. You got some players like Darnell Dockett, Dion Branch, and probably one of the most expensive ones is John Elway. Right now, he's going for about 800 k so let's not waste any time and go ahead and tackle Super Bowl pack number one. Now, this one right here is, will the Seahawks commit the first penalty? If they do, I'll get 5K coins. Jeremy Lane. Moving forward now, a couple gold players. A purple flash, Vinatieri game-winning kick, which belongs in that set that we are trying to do. Start off with a Brady drive. Moving forward now. A gold player, bronze badge, a red flash, and it is LaShawn McCoy. And now we get an Odell Beckham catch. That belongs in a Team of the Year set. And you know what? Since we're going all out with this episode, why not do a Team of the Year set? I'm going to bring it all for you guys. So in this pack right here, we start off with a Mason Crosby. Goal line stand. I definitely need these. 25-yard Rushing touchdown. Will there be a 25 yard rushing touchdown? If there is, I will get 40k coins. And there you have it. So, four more to go. We also have a signature pack, which I'll go ahead and open up for you guys. So, not only are we covering a Super Bowl promo, we're doing it all in this video. So, what are we gonna get out of this? KJ Wright, 86 overall, and we finish things off with Seattle scoring first. If they do, we'll get that amount of coins. So, Three Super Bowl packs to go so far. It's been straight. Nothing impressive. Nothing that made me jump out of my computer seat. But so far, it's been straight. Out of this one, we're going to end off with a silver badge. So will the final play be a kneel down? If it's a blowout and one of the teams has a kneel down at the end, I will get 15k coins. So that will be great. Moving forward here. Another Super Bowl pack. We get a Brady drive. So I'll go ahead and throw that one up on the auction since I have a few of those. I got an overtime coin up. Will the game go into overtime? 75k coins. If it does, then we finish things off with back-to-back -back gold badges. So here it is. The last Super Bowl pack of the day. Who will we get here today? We get Jamie Collins, a 93 overall elite. So will he be on my team or will we go ahead, place him in the set or will we just flat out sell him? We'll find out in a bit. So signature pack, I haven't done this in a while. We get LaShawn McCoy again. So not only do we get him out of a pack, but we get him as a signature edition as well. So here's the Super Bowl topper, this is Road to the Playoffs Elite and it is Michael Bennett. This kind of keeps the Super Bowl theme going since he's a Seahawks player. So, like I promised, Team of the Year set. I have four more collectibles to go. So, I went ahead and purchased it. And I finished the set. The last one that I needed was the, was the Brent Grimes one hit interception. So, after placing the remaining collectibles, here we are. Another Team of the Year pack. Who will we get here today? And it is Sebastian Vollmer. 95 overall right tackle and something that I have to say is as I'm putting these players up on the auction block is that I have not really concentrated on my offensive line so instead of going ahead and selling that team of the year I decided to finally go ahead and keep one of them so Sebastian Ballmer he will be on my team he will be starting and all these players that you guys see in front of you right here, I went ahead and placed them on the auction block. So I will not be doing the mystery MVP for now, but instead, like I promised, I will be doing the Super Bowl master. What is that called? Super Bowl, Super Bowl, yeah, yeah, the Super Bowl legend. That's what it's called. So 
after finishing the rest of the collectibles that I needed, here is the Super Bowl legend that I get, and it is Franco Harris. Hold up. Hold up. I didn't get John Elway. Not Darnell that not not Tracy Tracy Porter. But they give me Franco Harris. So as we compare him to Marshawn Lynch, there you see his stats. Right now he's going for about 117k. So what I decided to do was throw this guy up on the auction block and go ahead and buy some players whose values have gone down price-wise. So Clint Bowling, left guard, 95 overall. We're gonna improve our O-line. And like I said, I decided to go ahead and throw up Franco Harris up on the auction block for about 102k. He sold like momentarily, didn't take much time. A uh, Marshall Yanda team of the year 96 over our right guard he has been we, we just added three offensive lines and guess what a lot of you want to see this guy look how much his price has dropped antonio brown team of the year welcome to my squad i was like yo this super bowl promo is going on the team of the year players the prices are definitely going to drop so you guys see my lineup right now we decided to give russell wilson a break for one game and start Tom Brady and said, there you have Richard Sherman, the free edition, Richard Sherman, the Super Bowl edition, whatever you want to call it. He is cornerback number three. So we are ready to go ahead and see what this team is going to do. Although we don't have our starting point. Hold up. D did I just almost say point guard? You guys know what I mean. This isn't my starting quarterback. We do have Tom Brady in here for one game. So we're going to target Antonio Brown here early on. It worked there. So I decided to go ahead and run a no huddle. I think we have an advantage here against his defense. So Antonio Brown will be targeted here once again. There he is. Left wide open. Can he beat the safety spin move? Juke move. Get off of me. Bring out the red carpet just like that. Antonio Brown has made his debut with a bang. So with about two minutes left, my pony here with Troy Aikman, he's trying to make sure his team goes into halftime with the lead. Oh, that was supposed to be a pick. What the heck just happened right there? I was so mad and it just continued. He kept on moving the chains. There's 30 seconds left. It ends off being a Wes Welker touchdown. So, we start the second half. Things are tied up. And if you guys are enjoying this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Halfback toss. And he gets brought down by T. Sizzle. Back to the run game he goes. And he gets tackled down once again. So a huge third down coming up. Can we get a stop? Third and five. Troy Aikman, give me that. Richard Sherman, I think that is the Super Bowl edition. Gets the pick. And look where we are now. At the 29-yard line. 21, not 21. We're talking about 29. Antonio Brown. He brought the field goal zone defense. And that is what I had in response. So just like that, we have a 7 lead seven point lead and this happens like, like seriously I, I had a hand on it and, and he does a karate chop kick like I, I know that's a collectible Madden but why does this why does stuff like that happen against me so he ends up tying the game my next drive it was just disastrous I decided to punt the ball I'm not gonna go for it when I'm all the way in my own end zone so he ends up moving the ball you can see the clock is my enemy a run up the middle, another first down. So I'm thinking maybe I should start calling timeouts. A completion of Wes Walker here. He decides to stay in bounds. So I was like, all right, this is a pretty good time to call a timeout. The next play, he gets a touchdown. So I'm thinking, all right, if I score a touchdown here, I'm going to go for two and end it. I still have two timeouts. So maybe this isn't so bad after all. Tom Brady. Screenplay. Oh, maybe I should have cut to the outside. So the clock keeps ticking. Second and one. I see you, Antonio. He makes the catch, but the ball gets stripped out. So on third and one, I decide to run the ball and make sure I pick up a first down. We recovered it. Thank you. We recovered it. First and ten. I'm seeing one on one on the outside. And Tom Brady, aka me, under through the ball. And there you have it. We lost this game. 24 to 17 now this is disappointing very very disappointing 
but I think I like the direction that my team is headed. Now, next game, we will have Russell Wilson, so we'll see what he does. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. It's your boy, Antoine Boss, a couple days away from the Super Bowl. Let's see what's going to happen. I am signing out.